so today me and my lovely little girl Gabby here are gonna be showing you guys how to make the bunk beds that you guys saw in my American Girl doll apartment or as I titled it my American Girl doll house tour I'm gonna go ahead and guess that a lot of you guys are like oh my gosh this is so primitive you just take your two boxes and you like stack them up or whatever but you know these are not the classic like really really tall bunk beds I don't know it always bothered me how tall they were is that just me probably anyways these are my own bunk beds that I use my creative spirit to make and while, you know, if you saw the video, the doll house tour, you're like, oh, that's really easy. But if you're confused, this video is for you. Let's get on to the materials that you need. These are the materials that you need to make this little, easy, super quick, five minute DIY. Anyways, you're going to need two American Girl doll boxes. The type of box doesn't really matter as long as it's not the box that Gabriella came in or Tenny and Logan and Z come in. And personally, I would recommend choosing two boxes that are kind of similar. So for example, two of the Purple Girl of the Year boxes or two of the Truly Me boxes, two of the Just Like You boxes, etc, etc. Just so like kind of like the boxes are the same colors. But you know, you obviously don't have to do that. That step is optional. So for my particular case, I'm going to be using the box that Jackie, my number 37, came in and the box that Grace came in. So you'll also be needing two other kind of smaller boxes. Personally, the best fit would be the box that Mary Ellen's Poodle Skirt comes in, but again, um, that is your choice. I do not currently have two of that type of box on me, but a picture will be inserted. Like I've been saying throughout this whole video, this is very customizable, so if you would like to use kind of more of a smaller box, this is the box of Kit's Reporter set. If you would like to use that, go for it. If you would like to use a Mary Ellen's Flamingo outfit box, go for it, like a box that size, go for it. All you need to have is two of those boxes. For this specific video, I'm going to be using this box. This is just the standard box that basically almost every outfit comes in. All pajamas come in this outfit. Personally, these two are from the Warm Winter outfit and the Christmas Eve set. Now let's get started building. Yay! Okay, so now let's get to building. So why I'm making a DIY on this is because this is a little bit harder than just stacking boxes. So the thing is that your doll, if she lays down here, she is about almost the length of the doll box. So in order, when you put the two boxes on, you need one box to kind of be leaning on a little side, kind of in a way. I'm trying to like show this. Okay, as you can see, in order for Gabby to fit, one of these boxes has to be kind of leaning or, you know, she won't fit, which defeats the purpose of your doll sleeping on the bunk bed. The way to do this is just like I did, just kind of put your doll in and then make sure that she or he fits. And then um, you just put up the second box and ta-da, you guys have your doll bunk bed. You do not want to use like thick boxes because that actually takes up more room. So for example, if I use like two of these boxes, I actually don't have two of these boxes, so I can't do that. But I would have to use it more room, like the thinner the box, the better. Making this bunk bed before because you saw it in my last video and you're like, wait, why isn't this working? That is because you kind of need to have this like little section kind of over here. That's just kind of there because, you know just need to or the doll won't fit onto the bottom of the bunk and you can just end up decorating that with like i don't know i put doll cameras on it you can put like some fabric i don't know do whatever but you know just decorate you know have some fun with it it's yours like customize it be creative simple super easy um the top doesn't really need anything a doll can sleep on that no matter what and of course two dolls can sleep at one time let me like what the heck my tripod isn't moving up but there's the top and you know your doll can sleep on that just as she can down there grab your doll pillows your doll stuffed animals your doll mattresses your dolls blankets and get to decorating with all those things and if you don't really have like a doll blanket or a doll pillow honestly use an old shirt like that is so easy just use an old shirt and then two of your dolls have this amazing bug bed that they can sleep on during the night or day like you know i'm not judging your choice you know your dolls is choice you do you dolls of my friends <laughs> I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a big old thumbs up and comment down below if you guys would like some more DIYs because I think that this is like the first DIY I posted on my channel and it's not really even a DIY. It's like a fake DIY, you know, fake DIY.
would also like more videos in kind of this angle where you guys can like see my hands more what see my hands where you guys can see my hair that's exciting then please comment down below because honestly I'm a fan of this angle like it's kind of it's kind of cool do you guys like it I like it nice i don't know so if you guys would like more videos with this angle please comment down below because i'm definitely a big fan anyways i will see you guys all next week bye